All right. Um, let me know, everyone, if you can see my screen. Yep, yep, good. Ella, thank you so much. All right, cool. So this is only my second time in Demio here. And so, um, yep, it looks like we're, we're rolling good. And it's nice to see that we have um, a packed house today. I didn't know how many people were actually going to show up for the training live. So um, this is exciting. Um, I want you to see something here. Um, uh, you can see here I have about 15 tabs open up, okay? About 15 tabs open up here in my window. Now, that is not to overwhelm you, okay? My brand, actually, aside from Robert, is Wicked Simple, okay? I pride myself in taking complex things and making them simple, okay? Robert is the same way. He works smarter, not harder. Same concept, okay? So what I'm going to do here <clears throat> is I'm going to kind of, I'm going to give you a 30,000-foot overview, okay, which is actually module one of this training, okay? Um, and I'm going to go, uh, some of the stuff I'm going to show is going to be redundant to stuff you know. Some of it's going to be like, oh, wow, that's cool. I didn't even think about that in the process. You got to remember, this is just the process that I go through, stuff that Robert goes through in our businesses. So you may have different ways of doing things. You're going to have some light bulb moments going, it's it really that simple, okay? So uh, first thing off I want to start off is uh, I'm not going to spend a lot of time on this, but I want to lay some groundwork uh, groundwork for you guys. Hey, on... Sean. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm so sorry to interrupt you real quick, but you yep. said something that I really, really, really want to harp on real quick. And, and yep. I thought about this earlier. Um, guys, Sean's going to be showing you stuff. And then Thursday, I'm going to be showing you stuff. There's one important thing that now we're not we're never going to contradict each other. But there's some stuff that that I'm gonna tell tell you about that's kind of my way of doing things, and the the there's some stuff that Sean's gonna tell you about that is his way of doing things, and so some things might seem a little bit different. We're gonna make it as congruent as possible, of course. But what you need to take away from that is that there's more than one way to do anything, and there's no real wrong way to do it in the ways that we're showing you. Does that make sense? So we're not gonna show you like three different ways of doing things unless we're just giving you options, not to confuse you. But sometimes I'll say something that's like, oh, I kind of do it like this, but Sean may, may do it like that. Does that make sense? Okay, cool. I just wanted to get that out of the way. I'm going to shut up now, bro. No, all good. And I'm glad, you, I'm glad that you jumped in there because that's the thing. There's only ways, like Robert showed me something very simple the other day and about taking a screenshot for something. And I've been doing this some, a certain way for for uh how many years 10 years now and he's like dude you just you're it was ridiculous <laughs> i know i know robert and the thing is but i didn't know because that's the way that i learned um i've taken everybody's training else's training plus my own ex live experience and i've meshed it down into what works for me if you want to change something cool but we are giving you the basics here and giving you the confidence because i'll tell you what messenger marketing right here is so like we went over um last week on the call is so powerful that there's two things that happen. Or that there's three things that can happen. You can go off and you can thrive and flourish. You can make stacks of money with this and have happy clients and just make, just blow up your business. Okay. Or you can butcher it, do it the wrong way, and not make it uh, have it not work and get yourself banned. Or three, you can get oh so overwhelmed you don't do anything. Okay. And that's the main point of this whole thing is Robert and I are taking the overwhelm out of it, taking the scariness out of it. This is really a simple process. When you see the bot that I've already, I'm gonna actually, I've got two bots built out already, but I'm gonna rebuild them in front of you for, for a client, how to get a client, and then what to run for that client. It is so simple, okay? Like I was putting it together and it, it did not take me that long to put it together, but this has been taking me a year just to, just to get to this point, okay? And last thing I'm gonna say before we jump in here, you guys have no idea the timing of this, okay? The technology that we're using now, I would have killed for a year ago, okay? You guys are getting in right at the crest where there are not enough bot builders out there. There's not enough people implementing, but you guys have more than enough tools to actually do the stuff that you want to do. There's nothing lacking in mini chat right now. They could stop building right now. You'd have everything that you could possibly need to do what we're doing here, okay? So you guys, I'm a little bit jealous. I've gotten the crap beat out of me over the last year. And now we refined it down into a system, which I'm going to show you right here the next hour and a half. And then Robert on Thursday is going to take over and show you actually how to close these clients. So, okay. With all that being said, um, unless Robert, you got something more to, to interject here, man, I'm going to jump in and uh, here we go from the top.
No, nah, I promise I'm not going to interrupt you anymore, brother. Go ahead. All good. And well, please do if you see something that I, because one thing here, guys, I take for granted all the stuff that I know. And sometimes um, uh, I think, oh, you already know that. I'm going to show you the step by step by step. Okay. And if I miss something, Robert can poke me and say, yo, dude, can you show that again? Or if you guys have a question, um, hit him up in the chat and um, I'll, I'll jump in and you know, adjust course a bit. So here we are. Okay, mini chat. Uh, we went over on the call the other day and why we're we using mini chat. There's mini chat, there's, there's, uh, boy, there's several other ones. Okay, I'm not gonna list them all here, but mini chat is the go to because what happened is once messenger marketing took hold, mini chat took the reins, hired more staff, did live training, did a whole 10 hour course, and really stepped up the game. They have, one-on-one -on -one contact with Facebook daily just to make sure everything's seamless, not breaking terms of service. All these mini chat ha is invested in this platform now. And there are other ones out there. There's free ones, there's lifetime deals. But the thing is, these guys have everything that you need to back you up as you go through it. They've got the support, they've got the technology. And if something breaks, I'll tell you what, with their support group they have, it's gonna get fixed faster than anything because we're all, I don't wanna say we're beta testers, but we are all using this platform so much that if anything is going wonky, like right now there's something with a comment growth tool, well, guess what? Facebook, it's on Facebook side, it's all getting ironed out. So this is the tool and the best part is the pricing, okay? And for everybody on this call right now, okay, on this training right now, do yourself a favor, okay? Do me a favor, do Robert a favor, do your clients a favor, See this site, the one that says free right here? Absolutely ignore that. You do not want the free account, and I'm not saying that it's bad, okay? If you're just getting started and everything, you can use it, but save yourself loads of time and use the pro side, okay? And here's the, here's the reason why. You can have 500 people for only 10 bucks a month, okay? That is ridiculous, okay? And we can slide it up. Let's say you go gangbusters. I'm gonna go all the way to the top. 25,000 for 145 a month to send unlimited messages and have this all organized in one dashboard. The pricing on this, I, it just blows my mind. Absolutely blows my mind. And the fact that you can get started for $10, okay? And if it goes up $5 to your first 1,000, if this, because I'm, and the reason I'm harping on this is because I'm in their support group and I always get, people are always talking about using the free one. And it really irritates me <laughs> because for $10 a month, you literally are getting, you know, between how it's I, I don't even know the comparison but it's it's ridiculous how how powerful it is for that 10 bucks a month okay so mini chat once you sign up for mini chat um, I'm already signed up so I can't go through the sign up process it's really very self-explanatory you sign up and what happens first thing you're gonna do let me open up a new window here okay you're going to connect your page. It's gonna have you connect your Facebook account, okay? And then you choose your page. Here's just some of my pages, okay? You see, I've got several pro accounts here. Um, so what you do is you, <clears throat> excuse me, you click on your page and it'll go over to billing. Let's see, so we're here, we'll go over to billing, my profile, and um, I just don't wanna show my credit card stuff. So billing, you hit billing and it will put in your credit card and you're off to the races, okay? Very seamless, $10 a month. I'm off the soapbox about that. Okay, so uh, we have, like Robert said, we're doing the overview, and then I'm gonna show you how to set up a, a module two with setting up your client bot, or setting up the flow to get your client. Uh, module three was closing your client, which Robert's going over on Thursday. Module four was the bot you're building for your, uh, for your client. And then module five was Facebook ads. Now here's the thing with that flow, <clears throat> excuse me. We have to we have to start at the end, okay, and then work backwards. All right. But when we're as we're working backwards, I'm gonna have to show you Facebook ads in the middle of this whole thing. So we're gonna jump around a bit, but when once we get done, you're gonna have the complete package. You're gonna be like, oh damn, that was pretty freaking cool. I want to go set this up now. Okay. And remember, the point of all this is to keep it simple. Okay. So here's the main points we want to think about. We are running an ad that goes to a chat bot, okay? That chat bot is going to pre-sell your client on the need for them to have a chat bot for their own business, okay? Robert's gonna go over on Thursday how to close that client. And then what we're doing for that client, we're running a Facebook ad with a chat bot to close their clients, okay? 
So it is all, it just, it's mind boggling to even have that come out of my mouth. And I, <laughs> I don't see the live chat. So I really hope that this is making sense for you guys because it is so ridiculously simple that I don't know why anybody's not teaching, teaching it like this. Um, the way this all got birthed was I was like, I was, I couldn't get it. I couldn't get an ad to work. And then I was like, you know what, let's do, like we talked about before, the 100% transparency. The second I did 100% transparency, I was out of town in Portland and all of a sudden I got my first lead. I was like, no way. Ah, somebody probably just clicked my ad because whatever. And I got a lead and a lead and a lead. It says 100% transparency. That is the crux to all of this working because it lowers their guard and then we get them into our bot flow. So <clears throat> for this training here, actually, let me take a sip of water real quick. For this training, what we're going to do, we're going to pretend, okay, that you are going after gym owners, okay? Not personal trainers, but gym owners. If you wanna go after personal trainers, you use the exact same thing, but we're going to pretend we're going after gym owners, okay? The benefit of this is they are, they are the actual owner of the gym. <clears throat> they have re recurring billing and there's a low barrier to entry and they have a great thing to give away for free, okay? So when I said we're working from the, from the end, from the from uh, the end point backwards, okay. So our goal, the end point, is to get a gym owner as a client, okay. Now Robert's going to show you how to close them, but I'm going to show you how to go from the ad to the bot flow to getting um, to one of three things. We're going to either get in a live chat with them to close them, we're going to get to a phone call, or we're going to get to we're we're going to collect their email address. Okay, so so what, what we want to do here is I'm going to actually just show you the ad. Okay, let me see. There we go. Okay, so <clears throat> start from the beginning here. So we are going after gym owners. Okay, now you guys are going to follow me here because at first you're going to be like, well, yeah, well, that's not gym owners, but I've got a sneaky way how we're going to whittle this down. Okay, now <clears throat> the targeting that I do is going to be counterintuitive to probably what most people are teaching. I do shotgun approach and I let Facebook do the heavy lifting for me, but we got to give them a direction, right? So as far as gym owners go, I'm going to go with um, people who live in the United States. Okay. We're going to, I'm going to base everything off the United States. I'm just North of Seattle. So that's where all this is going to go from. Um, <clears throat> so people who live in this location, United States, my, uh, target market, I'm going to say uh, is 26 to 52 men and women. Okay. But we need, um, some targeting and I'm going to show you what doesn't work. And then I can show you what does work. So in a perfect world, I would type this in gym owner. Okay. That's what I ain't getting the gym owner on that list. Right. I'm getting the people who own certain kinds of cars. So that doesn't work. So what's our next best thing? So what's a gym owner is probably, we're going to say that they started out as a personal trainer. Okay. So we've got, I can put in personal trainer, but okay, let's see what comes up. Personal trainer interests. Now we don't want an interest because that could be, they just like Julian Michaels page or something. Okay. Uh, certified personal trainer. Sure. But my audience is going to be 10,000. So what can I do to really narrow this down? But I want a broad audience. Okay. So let's go, uh, let's head over to Google. And this isn't, don't worry, I am very cut to the chase about doing stuff like this. So I'm not spending the next 30 minutes on targeting, okay, or going over to Google or showing how to pick out magazines in that niche. I'm showing you one kickoff point, okay? So personal trainer certification. This is where, uh, so we know that they're somebody that's an actual, we want we want an association or something, okay? So what's, what's the first one? National Association. Uh, it's, it's, um, what's it stand for again here? Actually, we're just going to go to the site. If NASM is what it is, National Academy of Sports Medicine. Okay. So now I looked through their site. Okay. Now this may be a little bit broad for what we want, but the targeting, I'm going to show you here how awesome this friggin' targeting is. Okay. So NASM pop, pop up there. So our reach is 310,000. Okay. So, uh, I'm like, okay, 310,000. That's great. Well, let me head over to, and I'm going to show you guys something here that I stumble across, which is a side point to everything, but 
So I'm going to go over to their page. Okay. I'm going to go over to their page. Oh, that's the wrong page here. There we go. NASM. Okay. I'm over on their page and I want to see, is this actually about personal training or is it sports medicine where we're kind of jumping out of um, where, what we want to get to. Okay. So we're going to go reviews. I passed my exam a few days ago. I'm so happy. All my studying has paid off. I purchased self-study program. Okay. Um, okay. She doesn't say anything about personal training, but I've had little, no experience in the fitness industry. Okay. We're on the right page. Fitness recommending. All right. Perfect. This is what we want. This is a little bit broad, but they are getting certified in this sports, um, sports training arena. Okay. So I like it. I'll go with that. So we head back over here. So the thing is, Oh, the one thing I want to show you guys, look at this. I actually messaged their page and they don't have a bot. <laughs> I just put in test. Okay. At 731 this morning, I wrote in test and at 1108, they replied back. How can we help you, Sean? So if you don't think bots are brand new, but to where everybody's not incorporating them yet, you guys have no idea the amount of clients you have out there. I should have showed this um, on our other webinar because look at this. That's it. How can we help you, Sean? That's it. Nothing, no personalization, no nothing. And this is massive. I mean, they have um, over half a million people like this and uh, 595,000 follow that page. Okay. So just a, just a side note there, should anybody want to reach out to them? Um, so uh, we're going to go back over here. So here's the thing, guys, we've got an audience of 310,000 people, but we want to know that they're not just uh, took, took their certification and they're done. Okay. We need to, we need to narrow it down. Okay. Well, we typed in gym owners. And I didn't bring us back anything. So what do we do? Okay. Here's my trick. So they must also, you see how I did that? You know, this is redundant for some of you guys. I apologize, but I want to show this how we're going to just do a two layer, then we're done. Okay. We hit narrow audience. Okay. Small business. Okay. So you're going to have a bunch of things come up and you want the one with like 56 million or 39 million. Okay. People who list themselves, people who list themselves as small business owners or own a small business page on Facebook. Okay. Click on that. All right. Look at this. Now we are now down. We have 30,000 people. That is plenty for what we're doing. It doesn't take very many gym owners to get a hold of. Okay. So we have this narrow it down by small business owners. Now, here's the thing. If you want to, because the thing is, we're showing this one case study to a bunch of people. So if a bunch of people attack this, it really wouldn't matter. But if you want to get creative and start going down international sports sciences association fitness trainer you can start beefing up your audience like this fitness professional we're 31,000 uh certified personal trainer 32,000 so you can keep building on that if you want to okay make that thing as big as you want but having the small business business owners layer in here is going to uh, uh we're basically given given facebook a little bit more to work with okay if you want it down the road, expand it out, take that small business out there, you can. Um, so anyways, enough of that. On to placements, okay? So placements, I personally, and I don't know how Robert does this, but I personally only target mobile. Some people will um, have a problem with that because they want everything. I like, I like just strictly mobile, okay? No Instagram, nothing like that, strictly mobile, okay? Instagram, we, we're not doing anything with messenger bots with them anyways right now, but I would keep it simple. Okay. My personal budget is minimum of 20 bucks a day. You can start with five. I've tested up to a hundred to start out with an ad. And I actually got really killer results. Even starting with that. Um, this can be debated all day. You need to pick what works for your budget for your business. I'm actually starting uh, one with a hundred dollar budget uh, today. So uh, beautiful, man. yeah, I'll just, I'll um, let everybody know how it's going on Thursday. If, That's great. I'm glad you jumped. By then I'm out of, uh, <laughs> I, either I've burned through two hundred dollars, or uh, maybe I have some good results. Who knows? Well, that's. A, I'm glad you said that because I I've.